Mike, you uh, you had probably one of your better games offensively so far this season. How were you feeling out there? Um, felt good. I mean, just going into the game, just <laughs> we were focused on executing, moving the ball. And uh, we did that today, and I was just a recipient of some open shots, so that went well. But uh, overall, we just executed and really played well on offense. Xavier, obviously, this is you know a little bit of a, a change from the type of teams you guys were playing there down in Florida. They hadn't won a game coming into it. Was it tough at all to, to kind of get refocused for this one? Uh, we knew what we had to do with the task at hand. We had to get back on track. So we, uh, we were locked in, focused in practice when we got back here. Uh, to, took it as another game. You know, We didn't look at their record or anything. We know they had players out there, uh, had some good guys. So we just come out there with the same uh, mental attitude, and uh, mental attitude, and we just did that. Uh, for both of you, maybe Mike, then X, your memories of Marcus Howard last year and his thoughts in that game this coming Saturday? Uh, could you say that again? Sorry, just memories of Marcus Howard at Marquette last year and thoughts on playing those guys again uh, this coming Saturday? Memories, I mean, we lost last year. We didn't play well. But uh, this year, new team, new game. They got different people. We got different different group uh, that we're relying on. And uh, we're just going to listen to the coaches, listen to the game plan, and we're going to prepare for them the best we can. Uh, definitely start some practice this week. You know, got to have a great week of practice uh, leading up to the game. I feel like we do that, we'll have a good chance. Mike, you guys shoot 54% uh, from the field, uh, 21 assists on 29 made shots. What was working so right for the offense tonight just in general? Yeah, I mean, we really, we've really been uh, emphasizing that in practice. And um, at halftime, I think we had 14 made field goals on 12 assists. And uh, that was something we emphasized at halftime. And uh, just moving the ball, really executing on offense and Sharing the juices, that's been big for us, and that really worked for us tonight. How much does uh, getting out in transition help with your offense, too? It does. It d helps a lot because that's where we get a lot of easy buckets. Um, we got a lot of uh, athleticism, speed, and uh, that's where we could really use it to our advantage. Mike, how much do you feel like your role has changed going from last year to this year? Um, I mean, I'm older now. I'm in a more, le uh, more of a – before I was one of the young guys who was sort of behind and listening to the older guys and following their path. And now I'm like, I've sort of got to carry on their legacy. And uh, we got X, we got great leaders, but it's my job too to, to help them with leading because they can't do it all themselves. And uh, just really step up, be solid, do what we do, and uh, do what I can to help the team win. Xavier, how much does it help when Mike plays the way he does tonight and makes shots? Uh, helps a lot, you know. Uh, him, seeing him get going from three, especially uh, getting his shot going, uh, we all confident in him. We all know he can knock down shots. He's one of the better shooters on the team, so it's good to see him get going tonight. And hopefully, that keep carry up to the next game. I saw something uh, tonight that uh, Cartier Jada had the most assists of any K State player in history after the first six games of the season. What has changed with his mentality this this season, Xavier? Uh, he's just being just being a uh, point guard for us, you know, uh, leading the floor, being a general on the court, uh, doing it defensive and offensive wise. But uh, that's just been his goal is just attacking, attacking the defense and finding the open gaps uh, and getting getting the ball to the right people in the right spots. He um, he likes to uh, get it to the right spots. Everybody we had text messages, we had um, everything in the group chat as well. He asking us where you want the ball at, where you want it to be, where you want it in this pocket, you want a high low, anything like that. So he's done a great job of that and just distributing the ball to everybody. Mike, how's, how's maybe Carton? Cartier being more of a uh, a leader with the assists, getting the ball to people this year? Yeah, I mean, it's been great for us because <clears throat> we know that uh, he gets so much attention and he's such a good driver downhill and whatnot, and he could shoot it that he gets a lot of attention from the defenses and he's done a good job reading them and uh, finding other players to, and setting them up to make plays for themselves. And uh, he's, he's taking pride in it too. And uh, that's something that's really worked for him and us. I guess you lose that uh, 20 turnover tonight. What were some of the issues there? Uh, just carelessness with the ball. You know, we got to uh, tighten up, value the ball. Uh, they pressured us a little bit, uh, and they uh, went out to like um, just 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 of a zone, not a zone, but of a pressure um, press, and we got to just take care of the ball. Uh, I believe I think I had a couple turnovers on the night as well. Too many, too many to have. So uh, we just got to get better, take care of the ball, value the ball in practice as well.